Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. Now that we have created an Azure Data Lake Analytics account and Azure Data Lake Store account, we will go and upload some sample data to work with Data Lake Analytics. So basically there are two ways that you can upload data to Azure. The first thing is using Azure portal. So you just go to Data Lake Store and just say upload and you can upload the files from your local computer. And the second way is using Azure Storage Explorer. It is nothing but a desktop software that you need to install on your machine which provides an easy access to upload to Azure. So you really need not go to Azure, okay? So you need not uh, go and type portal.azure.com and go and uh, take the pain of uploading to Azure from the Azure portal. So you can do it everything from your local and it's a much much productive way to upload it from your azure storage explorer we will see how to upload in the demo so before uploading the sample data let me show you the sample data that i have created for our tutorial purposes so here we have uh, two different uh, fields or rather two different rows and uh, the ash symbol basically indicates that they are commented out so they are just for information and here we have some rows so the first column is nothing but your date and the second column indicates your vendor third column indicates your customer and the last column indicates the transaction amount so each record indicates a particular transaction conducted by a particular vendor with a particular customer for a certain amount on a certain date so this data is for 2008 January and similarly I have data for 2008 February and March. So first let's go and upload the data using Azure portal. So go into your data lake store and go into data explorer and within data explorer create a new folder and name the folder as a vendor because we have the vendor details and note that the vendor folder is created and here let me upload the file so just say upload and just say select a file and let me only select the first file the remaining two I want to upload using the Azure Storage Explorer which is a much better way to navigate your files in data lake store so say open and say add selected files once it is completed, you will get a notification. So just close the notification and go into your vendor folder. And since I am not seeing anything, let me refresh the folder and you see the file. So just click on that file and let me see the content which is present over there. And just verify the content, whether it has the same content and just close the window. So to upload the file using Azure Storage Explorer, First go to Google and just type Azure Storage Explorer and open the first link which, which is from azure.microsoft.com and if you go into that link you will see a link to download the Storage Explorer for free. So depending uh, upon your environment whether you are uh, using a Windows or Mac or Linux just download the Storage Explorer and once you download just install it just go into the storage explorer and uh, go into the connections and just add a connection so that will basically allow you to connect to your azure subscription and azure account so i did that and that's the reason why i am able to see the data lake store and uh, i'm able to see the data lake store and the vendor folder that i have created if you would like to learn more about Azure Storage Explorer, then just click on the second link, which is from docs.microsoft.com and they have a ton of documentation on Storage Explorer. So just go and uh, explore that. So within Azure Storage Explorer, just click upload and say upload files and go into the uh, place where you have the data and select the next two data sets and say open. So it will start uploading as a group. So just expand that. You will see the individual files that are being uploaded and their status. And uh, you have all the three files here. 
if you want to clear out the activities just say clear completed or clear successful so I will just say clear completed and if you go into your Azure um, portal you will see the two files that we had uploaded using the Azure Storage Explorer and you can just click into to see that we have the information for February and here we have the data for March thank you